Okay, here we are in the town of Stonehaven, where, once upon a time, we had the Glen Uri Royal Distillery, which was here, but it's not here anymore. All that's left is that somewhere there, as thou can see. However, if you want to zoom in on that, a nice wee miniature there, 13 year old, distilled in a year sometime. Please come on! Hand is So what is here now? Our modern flat. Captain Robert Barclay, who was the first man to walk 1,000 miles in 1,000 hours, built Glenuri Royal in Stonehaven. The first spirit flowed from the distillery on the 5th of January 1833. Barclay was the local member of Parliament and it was through his friend Mr Windsor that the distillery was granted the right to use the royal suffix by King George IV. The distillery was purchased by DCL in 1956 and largely rebuilt between 65 and 66. It was then mothballed, however, in 1985 and was then subsequently sold for a housing development. Bastards! Had it with a little whiskey and some, some ale, polluted with yeast. Now, now we're going on to this baby. Just get a close up of that. Monte Cristo, uh, number three. A banana. Cigars. Adult cigars. This is the sheet we are talking about. This is the cigars you are wanting, senor. Cogsy loves it when a plan comes together. Hand is far! Spong loves it when a plan comes together. Hand is far! Well, a further hello this evening. Um, whilst we're enjoying our aromatic uh, cigarillo from Havana, we're also enjoying our smooth, luxury dry uh, whiskey from Loch Nagar. And uh, some say that uh, particular things go well together. Cigars and whiskey, well, let's give it a try, shall we? Yes, I, I do have to say that the, the humble, uh, aromatic flavours of the cigar do indeed combine well with the luxurious warmth glow of the, the Scotch uh, Loch Nagar whisky. Hmm. 
Başka mı? 